Welcome to the Daily Word for Daily Living, presented by Great Oaks Apostolic Church, located at 25687 in Marietta, California. We're here to study God's Word so that you have excellence in living, and we're continuing in the book of Daniel. Now, there's been some few days that we've been talking about the favor of God, but let's look at Another aspect of gaining that favor. If you go to chapter 10, reading verses 2, 3, 12, and 13, we're going to look at decreasing. And while we humble ourselves before God, God will fight our battle. Join with me as we read God's word. And it reads, In those days I, Daniel, was mourning three full weeks. I ate no pleasant bread. Neither came flesh nor wine in my mouth, neither did I anoint myself at all, till three whole weeks were fulfilled. Then said he unto me, Fear not, Daniel, for from the first day that thou didst set thine heart to understand and to chasten thyself before thy God, thy words were heard, and I am come for thy words. But the prince of the kingdom of Persia withstood me, one in twenty days. But lo, Michael, one of the chief princes, came to help me, and I remained there with the kings of Persia. May the Lord have a blessing to the reading, hearing, and doing of his word. Now, when we look at verse 2 and 3, we see that Daniel had chastened himself. He had humbled himself before his God to seek God. And when he mourned for three weeks equal to 21 days something else was going on in the spiritual atmosphere there was a battle going on that Daniel didn't have to fight but that the princes of the air which were sent by God were fighting the other princes of the air of Persia in order for God to get that word to Daniel how many times have we humbled ourselves before God? And as we're humbling ourselves, we're seeking God and petitioning God, not realizing that we don't have to fight the battle. We just have to humble ourselves. Because when we humble ourselves, we are exalted. And then when we exalt ourselves, when, then we're a base. Daniel understood that the way to see God was to humble himself and decrease so that he could get an answer from God and that he could continue to receive the favor of God. Let's do the same thing. Decrease so that God can increase in your life. Remember that God is honoring the humble and he is not considering the proud. Once we decrease, he can increase. May God have a blessing to the study of God's word. God bless.